The canal boat tours offer cruises on several routes in Tonburi, Bangkok Noi, and Talingshan areas of the west bank of the Chao Phraya River. Along the canals, you'll be immersed in the green scenery, slow-paced, and rustic ways of life you would not imagine could exist just across the water from the metropolis of Bangkok. Longer cruises take you further away from the city. But if you've got only one or two hours to spare, head to Tha Tien Pier near Wat Po and hire one of these long tail boat operators for a cruise in Thonburi. We opt for a two-hour cruise ourselves. You have to negotiate the price, but expect to pay about 2,500 baht for the journey. And off we go. Turning into the Mon Canal, we left Bangkok's high rises and cities caves behind. Thonburi was the pre-Bangkok empire established over 200 years ago. As it turned into a suburb of Bangkok in 1971, its traditional ways of life started to give way to roads and facilities. However, the remnants of the old empire remain. And the simple and slow lifestyle plus these genuine smiles have never changed. Among the attractions along the canals are these ancient temples where the boat driver will be happy to stop if you want to have a quick peek at one of them. And of course, one of the most popular activities when you stop at any temples at all is to feed the fish. Then, we turned into this smaller canal, which we agreed was the highlight of the cruise. On our way back to the Bangkok Yai Canal, we had a quick pause at Ban Silapin. Ban Silapin is a traditional Thai house aging over 100 years old. Now it operates as an art gallery slash museum and it is a great place to grab a cup of coffee before we move on. Cruising the Japriya's branches and canals is a terrific way to experience the rustic local ways of life. An escape from bustling Bangkok without actually being away from the city at all. <laughs> <laughs> 